How'd it go? It was great, guys. Yeah. Like my report last week, we had tons of fun there. Oh, but the it big thing like for so me, much fun. it was great. I mean, we got to play Xbox 360 games, got to see some PS3 videos. A lot of people are slamming PlayStation for not, you know, making PS3 playable yet. Right. Well, but in due time, in due time, <laughs> exactly. But the big news, of course, was the Nintendo Revolution controller. Yes. And I was lucky enough to get an actual interview with Nintendo President Satoru Iwata. Actually, the nice. only one who got an interview the with him. Congrats thank you, on that. Yes, That's it was fantastic. good. But, you know, he, was, he stole all the headlines at TGS with this controller. So, you know, what he did was he talked all about the Revolution controller and he also held it in his hand for our entire hour interview. This man was proud of awesome. what he was created. <laughs> but, you know, we touched on some other subjects during the interview as well. And one of the things we talked about was the new Legend of Zelda, Twilight Princess, which was unfortunately slipped in 2006. Everyone was yeah. really disappointed yeah. about that. Well, here's what Awada said during my interview when I asked him why they don't just ship the new Zelda game for the revolution. Yeah. First of all, I'm very sorry, but uh, we could not keep a promise to launch the new Legend of Zelda game. Uh, by the end of this year. However, we still have another promise, and that is to launch the Twilight Princess for the GameCube. Some may say that it should be very advantageous for Nintendo to launch Legend of Zelda for Revolution, for the sales of the Revolution, but now that we have already made a promise to the GameCube user that we'll be making the Twilight Princess for the GameCube, we really don't want to disappoint them at all. Having said that, however, I am personally looking forward to seeing how Zelda can be played with this new Revolution controller. I'm really looking forward to see how Zelda can be changed by taking advantage of this new controller. And uh, I am actually pushing Mr. Miyamoto to show what kind of things can be done with the Legend of Zelda.